morning, you beautiful soul. Today's inspiration comes from something that I got during a meditation. You know, I acted really tough my whole life, and I was. I was really strong, really athletic, could handle anything. But inside, I was always terrified. And in the last few years, I realized, man, I'm really running a victim consciousness here. And so I really started meditating on that, on, on, on what that was about. And the answer I got was, a victim is created when pain is ignored. So if I want to stop being a victim, I need to stop ignoring my pain. Hurt people hurt people. We know that. When we hear of people who are abusive as adults, 99.9% .9 of the time they were abused as children. So when we don't acknowledge our pain and instead we stuff it down, we victimize others and we victimize ourselves. Little babies and children show us this all the time. If they get hurt, they need you to acknowledge it. Look, I have a boo-boo. I need you to kiss it. I need you to give me some tenderness, some love. We need the same thing as adults. We need to acknowledge our pain. We need to give ourselves tenderness, love. We need to cry, beat with a plastic bat on a pillow to get it out, whatever, whatever it is. We cannot ignore our pain because what happens is it leaks out in the way we say things, the way we behave, the choices we make, because subconsciously that victim is trying to get our attention so that we can pay attention to it, look at it, acknowledge it, heal it, and release it. Stuffing and ignoring it is a recipe for disaster. Notice what you're saying as you go about your day. Are you saying things that empower you or that paint you as a victim? We have been well-trained to deny and stuff our pain. And, we, and when we don't allow it to be looked at, healed, and released, we'll find ourselves speaking in a victim mentality. If you spend your day telling stories that paint you as a victim, find some time to get quiet and ask what it is inside you that needs to be acknowledged and healed. The more you acknowledge and heal your pain, the more empowered and free you'll become. And telling victim stories will completely lose its appeal. And as you go about your day today, treat yourself with tenderness and kindness. Give yourself a break. Life can be really hard. You're doing the best you can. Give yourself some kindness. You deserve it. Thank you.